Oh, who knew emotions could be so brittle? Well, down the vent they go. Ooh, anxiety. I wonder what she's up to. She's pulling levers. She's pushing buttons. Oh, now Joy has to clean up the mess. First, she's got to work that lasso. Here, Anxiety, let's keep you under wraps. Now excuse us. Oh, we're back in control. Anxiety's upset. Say goodbye to those eyebrows. And if she was anxious before... Oh, poor Joy! She's got 40 lashes! What's she up to? Ooh, she's making a foot mold. Now fill it up with some green slime. Add some beads. Joy's chock full of them. Let it congeal and give it to Anxiety. It's not a phone. Use it to relax. You can start by plucking out those beads. Ooh, looks like we got a big one. Anxiety's so relaxed, she regrew her brows. Oh, how cute. It's a little fox puppet. But a puppet needs a puppeteer. It's anxiety. She wants to push the button. It's a cute little catnap puppet toy. You can press these buttons instead. Push them to your heart's content. When you're done, just pop them back up. Uh-oh, looks like anxiety's gotten to the memory orbs. Oh no, not the red one. It's cherry flavored. Don't worry, Joy's got a plan. It's beginning to look a lot like Easter. What pretty eggs. Now grab some slime. Use it to fill up some empty eggshells. Now let's put a new face on things. Place it in a plastic bag and seal it up. Why don't you give it a good squeeze? Don't worry, the mess stays in place. Of course, some people don't mind the mess. Whatever's going on must be a real nail biter. That hangnail isn't looking too good either. Yeah, I'd stop pulling it if I were you. At least it leads back to the source. What we need is an empty dish. Well, we can always just clean it off. Paint a face on top. Look, it's anger! Now cover it up with some glitter glue. Twist and turn until the glitter glue's well spread. Here, Anxiety, take it for a swing. Poke it in the middle and peel it off. And isn't this a familiar face, Anxiety? Of course, Joy would make a face of her own. I wonder how they get those faces in the marbles. Grab some more. Hey, what's this? A moving fidget? 
take it for a ride on both of your arms. I'm sure even Anxiety would want to turn with this. Though, maybe not for long. Hmm, what's she up to now? Well, if you like spitting so much, try this egg. Add to water, and it hatches into a spitting dragon. Uh-oh, we need one of those magic napkins. Remember, add water is a suggestion. Some soda works just fine, too. Hmm, I think Joy prefers lemon lime. So close, yet so far! Even the party favors failed us. Looks like it's super elastic tongue to the rescue! Naughty, naughty. Let's take a balloon. Grab a funnel and fill it up with Orbeez. Don't forget to add some water, too. Make sure it's sealed nice and tight. Now it's fun to give it a good squeeze. There's more balloons where that came from. But we're out of Orbeez, so let's use starch instead. Try stretching this one. Careful, he doesn't stretch back. Uh-oh, think he might stay that way? Just don't squeeze too hard, or that'll happen. Here, some candy and pop might cheer you up. Wait, that's no ordinary soda. It's a growing potion. My, my anxiety. What big eyes you've got. It's big enough to go on a skewer. Two eyes are better than one. Make that three. These jelly eyes will go great with a chocolate dip. Let it harden and give anxiety another try. It's chocolate. You can't say no to chocolate. Ooh, you might want to grab a napkin. Make sure that soda. Well, I guess that proves it. No, oh, the control panel. It's going to short circuit. Joy seems calm, but anxiety's going into overdrive. Don't worry. Nanotape solves all of life's problems. We can whip up a teddy bear mold. Now fill it up with our special mix. We've got a brand new soda bottle. Careful, you don't want another spill. Of course, this one will peel right off. See, everything has a way of working out. We're having a guest over for tea time. Oh, I think that means he likes you. While you're here, why not relax with a clay rub? It's a mold. Let's use it to make a whole new frog. Don't forget, frogs are usually slimy. Of course, they're usually not see-through. Look, you can even cut him up. This will help you take a closer look. 
Oh, do you think we've reached the brain? Well, that's one way to clear your mind. Oh, he's got such a big heart. And lungs. Wow, he's sure got a clean colon. Just put everything back when you're done. Anxiety, keep your feet to yourself. Hey, you've got some paper in your hair. Let's cut it up and make it a cube. Now grab some thin strips of paper. Twist it up into a paper-made spring. Place the cube on top. Make a bunch. Add a bunch of emotions on top, too. Here, Anxiety, it's your own personal control panel. While you're distracted, let's keep you nice and safe. Ah, Poppy's on her throne. And look. She's in for a surprise. It's Jax. In fact, it looks like the whole circus is in town. And they're all extra squishy today. Let's see how far we can stretch these guys. Pomni's gonna squeeze them until she can't even recognize them anymore. Ah, a merry-go-round. They're so fun. But this pony's not like the others. Tissue? Why don't you grab that slime and feed it to our new pony friend? Press the tail and you get a surprise. And they taste great too. Apparently, Pomni's eyes look tired. I think she needs glasses. Your plasticine eye needs a checkup. Let's find the root of the problem. Ew, let's ditch all these pests. Put your eye back in one piece and stick it right where it belongs. Dolly, it's water. Do you want to take a dip? Ooh, looks like all your colors are running. Wait a second. You're not a clown. Guess we could use a new juggler. Next. Let's have some fun with Play-Doh. Place it inside and press the lever. Soon she'll get a new head of hair. Of course, you could still use a trim. And we can make shakes too, like a new bow. Hmm, the Ragatha looks not for everyone. Besides, brunettes have more fun. And Pomni sees a lot of herself in you. Hey, what's in the box? A button? Dare we push it? Of course we do! got ping pong balls, straight from the ceiling. Okay, they're kind of cute, but they could use a little bite. Some eyes, too. What a cute little face. You know, these guys sure love to hang around. Ooh. 
This just isn't Ragatha's day, is it? She's overdue for a little makeover. Our handy foot scrubber should help. Plus a few secret ingredients. Now let's scrub all your troubles away. <laughs> We're not done yet. She's breaking out. But our special tool should help with that. Ragatha's never looked better. But she could still use a little shave. Ah, the buzz cut. That's always in style. Well, better yet, Ragatha's classic look. Next, we should really fix your dress. We'll make it so clean, you'll think we washed it. Doesn't she look great? Ooh, a pony! Ooh, careful where you step! Quick, empty out that garbage bag. And use it to cover up our little equine friend. You should cover up if you're not feeling well. Let's add some eyes while we're at it. Now you'll really see where you're going. Careful, things might start spreading. Look, it's little Poppy and her friends. Uh-oh, Jax is in the goop. Don't worry, here's a magic scratch-off card. Scratch it off and just see what happens next. The more we see Jax, the more he rises. Little Jax is making his comeback. But we might need a quick shower. And playtime can commence. What's wrong? You're stuck on felt Ragatha! I think she needs some fixing up. Open her up. And take out whatever that is. There's all sorts of weird stuff inside her. And this thing's the weirdest of all. Let's open it up. It kind of looks like Ragatha's got spiders on the brain. And speaking of brains, why don't we clean it up? And put it back where it belongs. After all, a brain is a terrible thing to waste. Now we should patch her back together. Should be easy, she's already a rag doll. But we can't forget the best medicine. Love. <laughs> this candy cane's delicious, but fragile. Oh, what can we do? Wait a sec. Stick the broken piece inside a glue gun. And draw out a cute candy outline. For all your favorite cartoon characters. Before it dries, add a stick and it's a new lollipop. Hey, look, Pommy! It's Mr. Magic Mailbox! Told you he was magic! He's got mystery cards! 
To solve the mystery, just place them in some water. And an image will appear. You can even open it up to make a new friend. <laughs> so, let's see how many friends we can make. <laughs> Pretty soon, we'll have our very own amazing 2D circus. Complete with our very own tiny Pomni. Just wait till you see the 1D circus next. Oh, what cute little sandy bears. And they're just so fun to squish. Look, our little alphabet friends are inside too. Can you guess who's hiding inside? Unfortunately, something tells me that they're not going to be here for long. Oh no! Two has gone to the dark side! Stop it! You're going to clog the toilet! Oh no! Maybe we can save them! Add some colored paints. Some shaving cream. Glitter. Wow, they've made one big A. Let's give two a peace offering. Wait, what's she doing with that lip balm? Oh, she's turned our heart into a pimple. Make those pimples with plenty of pus. Speaking of slime, it's great for crafts. Pour some into a glass dish. And melt some wax on top. You can write whatever you want. But the real fun is cracking the wax. At least, until you get your hands on the slime beneath. Ooh, floral foam! It really leaves an impression. So let's add some glitter on top. And then cut out some slices. They slide right out, too. Why not also make a few scoops? While we're at it, I'd like a corner piece. Wow, you've made an M. And now you've made a mess. Sand's fun, and so are blocks. So, let's combine the two. We can use them to make numbers. The secret ingredient is glitter. Turn it over and get digging. Sure could use a shovel. It's a giant four candle. Eh, don't forget to make a wish. You got a little something. Ooh, nanotape! Let's make something with it. It's tea! Just add glitter. And a face wouldn't hurt. Ooh, he's squishy. Hey, careful! You just know that was planned. Well, can't waste good glue. PVA glue. Especially when you can add toppings. Now let's add some water. And really get your hands in there. 
Now we've got some really stretchy slime. Just don't stretch it too thin. Oh, Two's got a dog. And an interesting chew toy. Come on, play nice. You're breaking his heart. A can play that game too, with this plush number. Don't worry, she'll patch him back up. But with some big, oozing blisters. Well, let's get popping. Probably should wash your hands. Brushing your teeth is important too. But this watermelon needs extra help. Ooh, eyes don't go in there. Let's brush. And start digging through all of that slime. Pretty soon, he'll be able to taste again. Oh, look, eh? Two sent you a gift. Sorta. Of. It's an ear. Let's clean it up and unclog it. Uh, waiter, we've got a fly in our ear. Almost done with all that gunk. Just add some eardrops and a nice massage. Ooh, Two's got some squishy letters. Careful, you're squeezing them beyond recognition. Although something tells me that's the idea. In fact, we could just mash them all together. Not the best place to keep play. But it's always fun to squeeze in a little sculpting. Let's feed these numbers to our bear. Add to the back of his head. And soon, pasta will come out. Who knew pasta could be so colorful? Ooh, look, Two's got some bubble wrap. They're already fun for popping, but we can fill them up with paint to make works of art. And now we can get popping. Maybe you should be more careful. Or you can just start smashing. A's got the next best thing, a sandwich bag. Let's fill it up with foam, and we'll need a lot. Poke out an outline, like a number, and start squeezing. Oh, we can do better than that. Told ya. Ooh, a book? Is it a g -g -g ghost story? No, it's F! You know, you two have a lot in common. Just get to know them on the inside. See, you've even got his numbers. Well, numbers aren't so tough either. Make some out of pop tubes and give them a nice gypsum dip. Start bending and they break free. Uh, 
Of course, when they're stretched out, they're number one. Mm, I guess everyone loves donuts. Though the toppings are another story. Knowing too, I'm starting to worry about those donuts. Oh no! You could have just picked off the letters. Poor A. It's hard to lose good donuts. But bread can be fun too. They're like little canvases. And wait until you toast them up. Crumble them up and grind them into breadcrumbs. Better yet, pound them into powder. <laughs> Toilet paper is paper, hence the name. So I guess you could use it to write notes. And it's sealed with a heart on top. Do you think she wants to make peace? Just add water to find out. Well, we've got paper too, in cup form. Draw a number on top. And poke some holes in the end. That's one way to make those numbers cry. 